Hello everyone, this is Merck's blog, and I'm going to be playing Faster Than Light, or FTL for short. So let's start this, because you don't want to see this picture all the time, so I'm going to start a new game. I had a game started, but it's not going well. <laughs> so I'm going to play as the Kestrel, which I'm going to rename to something interesting. Let's name it Angelic Starship, because it is kind of like an angel because we're the good guys. So, let's customize our characters. James Pomeroy, what not name. I'm gonna call him Reese. And then we've got Fetus Varnas, which is kind of a cool name. But I'm gonna call her, him, her, Cassie, because I want a girl on my ship. And I, and we've got Scribblenauts. <laughs> we've got Maxwell. And um, I'll keep Maxwell, because that's kind of cool. Um, I haven't unlocked Type B yet, which is kind of sad, but anyway, this game is a really good game for roguelike players, and, oh, excuse me, <laughs> and if you enjoy a roguelike game, play it. I'm going to be playing for as long as I can that YouTube permits me, so let's start. So we've got data carrying and data that we have to get to the Federation fleet. We'll need supplies, so we have to explore each sector before moving on to the next. But we have to get to the next exit before they come. So, okay. Alright, let's get work to work. Let's jump and let's go. We. At. Oh. Blast. But I know where we're going. I don't like going into nebulas. And I fail. Because I forget to um, put people in weapons and shields. Maxwell. You beat no weapons. Engines. So we can avoid. Oh, these guys have an iron weapon. It's this weapon here. Which um, can take down the system. Which we have to be careful of. Um, luckily, iron wet shields do not damage our ship. Which is good news. That's why I'm trying to take out the weapons. Now I can take out the shield. Good news. I normally take out the weapons first, the shields, then the um, pilot, in case I keep missing. That or the um, engines, because it comes in handy. So that was a good start. We only got two damage, so we got a good um, start for us. So I'm going to upgrade my shields. Yep. Buy a power bar because that's what you need. Um, because I want to upgrade these shields, so I'm going to be playing this as long as I can. There's a store there, but I don't want it. So um, let's go this way. This is an awkward moment because ah, so we have to just wait. Um, I'm not jumping backwards because I do get a bit nervous about the rebel fleet. Oh come on. Oh! <laughs> Run, Cassie! <laughs> I didn't even notice that! <laughs> uh, that's the problem in being in, the, in a nebula. You don't know if the um, ship's on fire. I should have checked, to be honest, but now I can send Cassie back in. So now let's jump. Um, we're going to jump to here. We're in the civilian sector, so that's safe. Um, let's age the civilian ship. Um, attack the weapons as usual. <laughs> she just fixes it and then it blows up. Right, I need to repair this quick. No, you stay on weapons for now. Um, We'll take out his shields too. Or one of them. And now we can have more chance to um, repair this. So, oh, he's gonna fire again. They automatically charge even if you haven't got someone in there. It just helps. And now we can. I really need to close the door. And we're going to burst laser their weapons, and boom, they're dead. Victory. 
anti-bio beam. Ah, I know this weapon. But I'm gonna, I'm not gonna use it yet because it's not good against um, shields. So I need more weapon power first. Um, see, this is the rebel fleet. This is worrying because it's getting closer. But we need to go as down for as many beacons as we can. Uh, so he's hacked our engines, so we've got a little bit of a problem. But we've got two shields, so we're safe uh, than normal. Come on, Max 12. Blow them to smithereens. I'm a bit evil in this game, so I. Oh, actually, I'm going to target the um, weapons again because they're rebuilding it. And. Oh, for goodness sake, stop rebuilding the weapons! I don't normally use missiles because um, it's better that um, it's better to save them for the harder ships that are later in the game. Um, I probably could survive that because he does only have one beam weapon and one and laser weapon. But just in case, free fuel, a bad jump. Um, hmm. Let's go this way. Oh, that's not good. I want to take out those shields first because, oh, sorry, I'm a bit tired today. And um, that's why I'm rubbing my eyes a lot. Now, I'm taking out their O2 because this is always comes in handy to take out their O2. You get more scrap. Oh, come on. Well, it still gives us better. Um, we can't actually upgrade the ship because of the asteroid field, but we're actually safe because of the shield, so it doesn't matter that much. Um, yeah, I think I've planned out my route now. Sorry, it takes a little while for me to actually um, aid the Federation ship. Wow, that was really lucky, Link. Um, I'm gonna activate my. Oh, I can't activate my Artemis. Cause, um, I have to. Um, just let that out. Let that out. Back that. My drones is fixed. Now I can get the shields. The ones that I want are the ones that are really stupid where they can't rebuild their things. Also tip, um, I learned it from another YouTube player who um, actually said, take that off. Oh. Right, um, yeah, I should, I'm going to get to the quest because I'm going to not, I'm not missing a quest because I can get a, hmm, actually I've got enough fuel at the moment, I'm going to upgrade my weapon system and buy another power bar because then if we get one more power bar we can upgrade the anti bio beam so if we take out their shields we can take out their um, units clever eh which I was amazed thank you now now we have two weapons charging this one will fire first which is good news um, also, good news is I may be able to visit two more before I jump to the exit. So, sadly, I haven't upgraded my um, subsystems for. Um... So I have to guess um, where they are. <laughs> but that will come handy to tell me where they are. 
hopefully, because it will hurt them. <coughs> well, it's if it hits the room, they're in. But I'm going to upgrade my sensor soon, so um, I can see what's in these ships. Alright, I'm going to risk it because I think I can make it, but that's it. I'm going to be a hero. Hmm. Luckily they won't be able to... But, oh, the shield's blocked it. Sorry. Um. Oh, I've only got three minutes, so maybe I'll stand it when I get to the jump beam. Oh, last. No, I have to get rid of the shield and the um. Are you in here? So now I can jettison the air out, so the shields can be repaired. After the flames are out. This is the problem about. Um, now I just have to. Re oh yeah, because I can do this. Supposedly, if you open all those doors, you can um, get more air into the rooms. So let's rebuild our shields. Oh, actually. First, I'm going to put some healing so Cassie doesn't die. We love Cassie. Put it back to repair the shields. I'm going to be repairing the shields and... See. Blast. They got there before us. Um, that isn't good news. Um, like, I'm not going to say it. But I am going to buy this. Now I can see where their enemies are, um, which is very good help. Um, let's actually get Reese into there to help because it'll get quicker. You three people. All right, Cassie, good job. Um, and in you go. So let's get ready to jump and fight one ship or flee from one ship. Oh no! We actually beat them to it! Right, so I'm actually going to end it here on this sector and we'll see what next sectors are. There's a civilian and a rock. I'm going to the civilian because I prefer that and there is a red one here and I may go down the red ones later. So, thank you for watching my video. Like, comment, subscribe if you really want. I don't mind. <laughs> um, and have fun. Enjoy videos and be happy.